What is up, everybody? As always, it is Max D I F H doing it for her, Birdie, whatever you want to call me. Back at you with UFC Undisputed Three's uh, series that I do called the Road to 100 Ranked Victories. And today I am doing something a little different. You guys have been asking for more fights per video, so this is two fights in one. This is going to be episode seven and eight in one video. Now I'm going to keep doing these uh, special episodes every once in a while like special videos I have the special pride fights I do every time a, a video reaches a certain number of uh, likes I will do those and every time these get highly demanded and then I might put an annotation up like yay if uh, we can get this one up to a certain amount of likes I'll now do another two in one but this is episode seven and eight put together now I do have some bad news again I know in the last video I talked about uh, there was some bad news how I lost a fight I mean, lost the footage to a fight that I won, so now it's forever gone. Well, my dumbass was clearing my video section and had accidentally deleted two fights that I won uh, the other night, so those are forever gone, too. I already had a special uh, episode 7 and 8 video already planned, and I had two fights recorded and was really happy and was going to do it, and then my dumbass actually went and deleted them, so they are gone. So I hopped on today and did two more and hope you guys enjoy them. So by the time we get to the end of the series, like there's 100 videos uploaded, I will be uh, at 103 wins. So that's three fights that won't get seen, but I'll make it up to you guys around the end of the series with some special videos and some special player match videos. But there's the victory of the, the first fight. Now he, uh, you guys have been telling me that I need to you know, work on my counter punching and my swing, and that's what I'm doing. That's another point of this series is for you to all watch me get better and for me to get better as I continue and let you guys help me, you know, for the journey to getting 100 wins. But that guy was, like, really, I don't know, swing happy, and uh, he really didn't know what he was doing when it came to being on the ground, so I got mad and took him down and showed him how to ground and pound. And uh, now this that was the first fight. This is against a whole other player, as you can tell to the right. It's a different gamer tag. They both used Rashad Evans. And he gets me with a good head kick right there. And then I go in to do something right here, and he head kicks me again, getting rocked. Like, And then I go to take him down, and he head kicks me a third time and rocks me, but doesn't capitalize too early. And now this is when uh, I get really timid and start the comeback. And he starts throwing a lot of head kicks, and then I start realizing, well, if I can back up and counter these at the right time, I can get him with some like good shots, and it ultimately leads to the victory. You guys will see; it's pretty cool. Now, uh, I don't really don't understand why people always can uh, like kind of cry about not saying not really cry, but a lot of people complain about side control. I mean, I know it's a really effective position and shit; it's really good, but I'm not bad at getting out of it. You'll see; he gets me in it. I, I'm, I've never really had a problem with side control, other than when I didn't know how to deal with the the knees, the strong knees. I, uh, I'm good at getting out of those now, I don't have a problem with them, but side control I can get right out of, and I don't have a problem like a lot of people do. See right there, I'm trying to time, I'm trying to get the timing of his kicks, and there's a land a good head kick right there, and uh, I'd go for another one, but he gets a really good takedown, but back to the side control thing, is you guys just need to, you know, pay attention to if they're going to transition, or strike, and right there I thought he was going to strike, so I didn't block, and he got me, but look, I get right out of it, I timed the... Blocked the two punches and then timed the transition and got right out of it. And this guy wasn't good at working the ground, so I easily got out. So you guys just need to like take what I do and look at it and try and put it into your own fights because I'm very good at getting out of ground positions. And here I go again trying to time his shit and land some good shots, but it's not working. I was trying to go for like a really cool knockout, but he kept taking me down and like I said, does not know what to do on the ground, so I was getting right back up easily. I try to keep my fight standing, guys, but... I get mad and then go back to what I'm good at. See, like right here, I'm just gonna boom, like German suplex him and then rock him in side control again. He did not know how to block from side control, so it made it really, really easy for me. And right here, I was gonna go for full mount, but he was transitioning too fast, and I was trying to get the timing of his counter down, and uh, we just got really timid. And then he tries to wall walk, and he gets up, and then we're gonna, the round's gonna come to an end. We're gonna, like, start, he's gonna clinch and I was going to go for the knees but I didn't see that the round was coming to an end. Here it is right here. I was going to try and put him up against the cage and you know KO him with some knees but it did not work out. But uh, here, we're going to check out the replays and then we go into the second round and the fight continues. So uh, let me know if you guys really like these uh, two in one episodes and if I keep getting a lot of like first round knockouts or first round submissions or stuff like that, first round TKOs, I'll keep making these because uh, it's, I don't really want to upload, you know, two-minute videos and stuff just of one fight, so if I get, 
like three knockouts in a row or something, you know? I might upload them as a special three-in-one video, but I'm not going to do these all the time, so don't always beg for them, you know, guys? So uh, if we can get some videos up to a certain amount of likes, then that's when I'll do it. So if we can get this one, I'll say, to 40 likes or 45 around there, maybe hit, hit 50, I'll do a special three-in-one within the next couple episodes. So give it some likes, guys, and that lets me know that you guys really want to see it. And then from here on out, that's what I'll just keep doing. I'll put a little, like, annotation up or something that says give it this many likes and I'll do this. So uh, I'll continue doing the special, you know, two-in-ones or three-in-ones videos. And I'll keep doing the special pride fights. So uh, stay on the lookout for those annotations. And then here we go. I just keep trying to get the timing down because this guy's, like, super glued to trying to put his foot in my mouth with his head kicks. So I'm trying to get the timing down, but he's just spamming like left hooks and shit, so I don't know what he was doing, but right there, I, if that would have been a little bit later, I would have got him right there, but uh, I give him the, that's my specialty, I like run up and then jab him in the stomach and then throw the hook combo, that works all the time, but there's a front kick to the face, guys, and he goes down from the rock one more time, I think that was third time being rocked, maybe second, I'm not sure, you guys uh, will see the video, I, I forgot already, I get distracted from these commentaries, but there's a special two uh, episodes in one video, everybody, I hope you enjoyed it, two wins with Shogun, let me know who you want to see me fight with next, thank you everybody, see ya.